For Taiwan's Matsu Islands, the arrival of these Chinese visitors is a breakthrough and a sign of hope for things to come. Between a souring of relations with Taiwan in 2019 and COVID travel restrictions in 2020, Chinese tourists have been barred from travel to anywhere in Taiwan. But China is starting to lift this ban. First, in the Matsu Islands, and soon, it says, in the Jinmen Islands as well. Both are Taiwanese outposts much closer to the Chinese coast than to Taipei, and they are hungry for the return of the lucrative Chinese tourist market. While only residents of China's coastal Fujian province are allowed to visit for now, some politicians are happy with the development. Taiwan's travel industry hopes the government will make a goodwill gesture of its own. Earlier in the year, Taiwan banned group tours to China, part of a pattern of worsening ties. But Chinese destinations are popular, and travel agencies want the ban lifted. The government hasn't made any commitments, but says it too is happy to see at least a limited tourism from China resume. Whether tourism between the two sides will reopen further, though, is unclear. China maintains its claims to Taiwan, and ties are as fraught as they have been in decades. But for the outlying islands, at least, the prospect of Chinese tourists returning just in time for China's long national holiday in October is a welcome prospect. Luffy Lee, John Van Trieste and Ed Moon for Taiwan Plus.